Hello, my loves. Welcome to your love reading for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Um, all right, let's see here. Spirit clarity, guidance, love messages for Aries, please. Tell me about Aries. Ooh, we have the Seven of Swords pop out. Tell me about Aries, please. What does Aries need to know, please, Spirit? Tell me about Aries, please. Tell me about Aries, please. What do we need to know here for Aries today? Okay. What do we need to know here for Aries today? We've got the Judgment card, Sagittarian Energy, the Eight of Cups in the reverse, the High Priestess, Cancer, Piscean Energy. Tell me about Aries, please. Tell me about Aries, please. Tell me about Aries, please. We have the Devil, Capricorn Energy. Tell me about Aries, Too many cards. Tell me about Aries, please. Tell me about Aries. And the Justice card, Libra Energy. Under the deck, we have the Ace of Pentacles. We have the Five of Cups. We've got the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. We've got the Sun and the Emperor under the deck, Leo, Aries, Taurus, Energy. Okay, <clears throat> so Aries. I feel that someone here made a very, very, very bad judgment call. Someone here either took advantage of somebody, someone lied, cheated, you know what I'm saying? Uh, left too quickly, maybe, you know, got into an argument, left too quickly. Um, I feel like someone made a very bad decision. With the High Priestess and the Eight of Cups, someone's intuition is telling them to go back or to come back or to return where someone here is secretly wishing that they would come back the thing is with the devil and the justice card is that someone here is actually paying karma you know what i'm saying that this is someone's karma for for what they've done i feel like we should someone wishes that they can go back Ace of Pentacles, and I mean go back in time. Ace of Pentacles, the Five of Cups, and the Knight of Cups. Aries, I feel like an apology is coming in. I feel like someone is very mournful, very regretful over what happened. I feel that with the Knight of Cups, someone is coming forward with a very uh, sweet, romantic type of situation here. I feel like someone here is realizing that... They had an emperor on their hands. They had an empress on their hands. This can also be an indication that someone maybe regrets not taking an offer. So Aries, someone here may have been offered, you know, the world. Ace of Pentacles is a beautiful offer, prosperous new beginning. Maybe someone here regrets not moving towards that offer. Let's see here. Spirit, tell me about Aries, please. Tell me about the Seven of Swords for Aries. So there you are, the King of Wands and the Death card in the reverse. Aries, there may have been an energy here where somebody didn't want something to end or somebody didn't want change. Tell me about the Judgment card for Aries. Ace of Swords in the reverse. Someone here made this decision not being aware of the consequences that it would bring. Tell me about the Eight of Cups in reverse. Ooh, two of Wands and the Star, Aquarian Energy. I feel like someone here um, envisions daydreams, healing, someone returning, someone coming back or going back. Seven of Pentacles and the Eight of Cups. Somebody here thinks about the day that they left or thinks about the day that they said no, you know what I'm saying, and walked away from something. Tell me about the High Priestess for Aries. We've got the Moon in the reverse and we've got the Five of Wands.
I feel like someone here is secretly very angry or very jealous or very upset. And they're not going to be able to hide that much longer. Yep. So we've got the Knight of Wands, Aries Energy, the Eight of Wands, the Eight of Swords, Temperance, and the Six of Cups. I feel like someone is rushing in with a lot of communication. Now, Aries, that could be you. That could be your person. Someone here cannot get over an ex and wants to make peace. Wants to make peace. Tell me about this devil card, please. The High Priestess. Tell me about this devil card and this High Priestess. Yeah, someone here... <sighs> Aries, someone here, I feel is operating from a place of anger, rage. Someone here has become hard-hearted is what I'm hearing. And their intuition is telling them that this is over and that this can't come back together again. And it's deserving. Do you see what I'm saying? It's deserving. But it doesn't stop somebody from wanting to work things out. Hoping that one day they can heal the lies, the betrayal, the walking away. You know what I'm saying? Tell me about this justice card. Justice card, please. The lover's card in the reverse. Someone here ended a relationship or chose someone else. Someone here either decided that, you know, new love would be better or they just ended a connection. Someone's paying their karma for that. Knight of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Energy. The Five of Cups, please. The Judgment card in the reverse, Sagittarian Energy. The Knight of Cups. The Six of Wands and the King of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Energy. The Ace of Wands, Five of Pentacles and the Ten of Wands. So what's happening here is Aries. I feel that somebody left a situation or said no to a situation or refused a situation because they didn't want to change or they didn't want to let go of something. And they thought that down the line, everything would work out and everything would be good. They're now realizing that with the Five of Cups and the Judgment card in the reverse, very bad judgment call. With the Knight of Cups, the Six of Wands, and the King of Pentacles, um, I feel here that somebody uh, may feel like if they pursued <coughs> that offer, it would have led to them being in a successful relationship, marriage, commitment, whatever the case may be. Instead, they chose the newer option or they chose another option. And now with the Five of Pentacles and the Ten of Wands, um, <coughs> someone here is having a really hard time. Someone here is having a really hard time, maybe even financially. I don't know, but someone is having a very hard time here. Is there any hope of this coming back together again, please, Spirit? We've got the Queen of Cups in the reverse, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy, and we've got the Fool card in the reverse. Aries, someone here sees it as a risk. They're not willing to put their heart out there anymore. They they see anything that you say or, you know, vice versa as an illusion as an illusion. Someone here just simply does not trust the other person at all. Okay, trust is completely gone here. Okay, and there's a knowing that if I would have just done the right thing, I would be in a very happy place right now. You know, I would be in a good place if I would have done the right thing. You see, someone is coming to the realization that they could have had it all. They could have had it all. They're, they're seeing now what they could have had. And that offer is no longer on the table. Okay? All right, Aries. I love you so much, and I will see you soon. Bye, my loves.